Hey friends, welcome back to another homeschool planning video. I know you all are just itching to see my 21-22 curriculum picks, but guys, I'm just not ready to show them to you yet. I'm still getting things here. We've actually had an unexpected car expense that ate up pretty much all of my homeschool budget. So I'm having to regroup and replan some things. So I'm just not ready to show you what we've picked yet because I just don't have everything here. But what I do have is the schedule that we will be using for next year. And I thought I would show you that just to tide you over until that long anticipated curriculum picks video. Now, I have done a video showing you how I make this um, schedule and I tell you how I use it and all that. I will leave some of those links down below. This is the only thing I plan out for the entire school year, you guys. I just look and see on each day what lessons I need to do and I do one lesson out of each one of the things that I have not blacked out and that that's how I plan our homeschool year. It took me all of 20 minutes to come up with this and print this out and write it up and I'm done for our homeschool schedule for the week anyway um, for fifth grade. So let me just run through here. You can see it, but I'll just run through real quick what I'm doing and kind of let you know uh, the daily schedule that we're going to have. So I have six things left open that we're going to do on Monday and we'll do either typing or handwriting. Whatever we don't do here Monday, we'll do on Friday. So this is just one or the other in this box. Now my son looked at this before I came up here to film and he said, Mom, what if I feel like doing two handwritings in one week, can I do two typings in another week? And I said, that's fine. We'll just, we'll just play it by ear, but we are just going to go back and forth on Mondays and Fridays with handwriting and typing. This box here, Spanish and Art, is a semester box. So one semester we're going to do Spanish on Thursdays and Fridays, and one semester we're going to do Art on Thursdays and Fridays. So I will show you uh, after I do my whole big curriculum haul video or curriculum choices video for you. I will go through and do individual subject videos as well because we're not going to be doing these things all as scheduled and as written in the curriculum. So I will show you what we are in fact going to be doing. So on Monday we have six things that we're doing as well as Tuesday, six things that we're doing. But on Wednesday and on Friday we only have five things that we're doing. Thursday is another six day. Uh, so that's a change from last year. Last year, or this current year that we're finishing, we did six different uh, lessons or subjects each day. And I decided that since Wednesday will most likely continue to be our music lesson day where we go for piano lesson, I wanted to just give me a little bit of wiggle room to maybe uh, make that day go a little smoother. So we knocked off one of our lessons and are just at five. And Fridays, just for fun Friday, field trip Friday, those sort of things, end of the week, we wanted to make it a little lighter as well. And part of the five that we have are handwriting, typing, Spanish art, you know, super fun and quick things that we can get done uh, pretty quickly. And spelling is just our spelling test, no lesson here. So really on Fridays, all we have are two different lessons, uh, language arts and history. So that'll make for a fun Friday for us. But this is all I do for the whole entire year as far as planning out our weekly schedule. I will do a separate video on how we're going to actually schedule out the lessons and all of these different subjects once I've shown you my curriculum choices video. But I thought I would give you this very quick look inside our schedule for the upcoming year just to give you something to, to look at for our 20 one twenty two plan. I'll also let you know that we are going to continue with the Sabbath schooling method. I will leave a video down below or maybe two videos I think where I talk about that. That is working so well. We love it. I'm definitely going to stick with that next year. So this uh, will just be another part of our homeschool schedule plan. This weekly schedule which will fit in our year-long Sabbath week schedule and then I will give you uh, what a daily uh, schedule looks like in our home when we get all our curriculum here. All right, so just wanted to pop on real quick because so many of you have asked me about next year, and this is something I can tell you, and you'll just have to be a little bit patient with me until I can show you the rest. Take care, everyone. I'll be with you again soon in a new video.